Welcome back. It is time once again to get knee deep in my wealth of useless trivia. Yeah, this time we're going to cover everything from toiletries, sort of, we'll explain in a minute, to what roller coasters have to do with immoral behavior. I told you it was useless. Take a look. A lot of people love roller coasters. Not me. Most of you do. Did you know roller coasters were actually invented to distract Americans from sin? That's right, hosiery businessman LaMarcus Thompson said, too many Americans are going to saloons and brothels, so he built the first roller coaster in the United States at Coney Island to give New Yorkers something good to do with their time. How about this one? It's impossible to hum while holding your nose. I know you want to try it, go ahead. Uh, the air has to escape through your nose and able to cause that tone to resonate, so <laughs> you explode. How about this one? Three Musketeers candy bars in the 1930s originally came in three flavors, vanilla, chocolate, and strawberry. But then World War II rations made that too expensive, so they went down to just one, and it stayed that way ever since. How about this one? Before toilet paper was invented, corn cobs were used. With, I, I have so many questions that I can't talk about on TV. Did you know there's a special kind of ant found in a 14 block area of New York City? Not kidding, they're called Manhattan ants. Manhattans. That's not a dad joke, it's the truth. Yeah, the Eiffel Tower, we think of Paris immediately, right? Did you know that Gustav Eiffel actually designed that for Barcelona, Spain? But the people in Spain said, nah, it's ugly, we don't want it. So they offered it to Paris, France. They took it, but as a temporary monument to the 1889 International Expo they were having there. I guess over time, they just said, eh, just leave it. There you go, useless trivia that will not help you in life, but will make you fun at parties. Now you know. I still can't get over the corn. <laughs> the corn thing. So I sat there and then we got into this big discussion oh, in the newsroom gosh. and people were going, is it corn when it's still soft or is it the cob when it's soft? Like, please, either those people were really tough right. and we're yes. just a bunch of wimps now. Because I feel like it would just like cut up your skin Scratchy. or yes. something or if it was soft, you'd get mush on well, you. Like, I, I feel like you would be dirtier. <laughs> when I saw the trivia thing, it said before toilet paper and I was thinking, oh, leaves right. or something. Or washcloths or but potato sacks or something. <laughs> right. Not corn cobs. Sandpaper. <laughs> oh! <laughs> it's just as bad. That's right. But the other one was uh, the Eiffel Tower thing. Um, I, d I thought it was built for France, you know, for Paris, but uh -huh. it was built for Spain. And when it got over there and they showed him the design, they go, we think that's ugly. And so he goes, okay, I'll offer it to France. And they had an expo <laughs> coming up that year, late 1880s. And so France took it, but it was going to be temporary because even some of the Parisians didn't think it was that good looking either, but it ended up staying. I like the Three Musketeer part. Like, how great would a strawberry Three Musketeer be? I, I was thinking of that. So then you don't delicious. like it that part. I mean, I don't like it. <laughs> it made me thinking, had me thinking about strawberry Yeah, three I wonder why they never went back to it after. You would think it would be easy to do. Or and they already had the machinery probably in right. place, but sugar, I know, was rationed during World War II, so they probably couldn't for Well, a we could probably reach out to them. We could. Media. We could write yes. something out. Because you know they're say, always we heard. Yeah, coming out Hashtag with limited edition things or something like uh -huh. that. We could take off and maybe they'll give us a cut. They probably the would. They probably yeah. send us like two of them, two candy bars. <laughs> Split it, it three yep, ways. Uh -huh, yep, have fun with that. <laughs> Um, I like this useless trivia. Is this going to continue? Yeah, we're trying to do this every Tuesday. It's so funny. I could give you the most accurate weather forecast, but this is what people remember when we do the useless <laughs> no, I trivia. Love this. They love it. You're so. gearing me up for Jeopardy or the next True. game show. <laughs> now, when that corn cob question comes up, oh, yeah, what is corn on the cob? <laughs> Ken.